Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm DJ Kelden the Antidote. Yeah, welcome to another fantastic uh, tutorial on virtual DJ. Yeah, this is common question I've been getting on how to add lower thirds on uh, virtual DJ. Yeah, it's a very simple procedure. Uh, hope you're going to learn something new from this tutorial. Make sure you have a license version of uh, virtual DJ so that you can enjoy all all the function or the package from virtual dj yeah how to check if yours is license just come to the settings up there let me just minimize this video you're going to show to upload it later come to licenses as you can see mine is licensed it has my dj name my email and also if you check on this part it's not reddish if yours is red timis is not uh, licensed yeah, this is how you you confirm your is licensed yeah you can download the virtual dj trial trial version from the virtual dj website it is www.virtualdj.com where you can also buy some licenses as you can see this one is a uh, nine nineteen dollars per month in my country this is the kenyan shilling around nine, one thousand nine hundred kenyan shilling yeah if you want to get the full version also you can pay for the full version you want to uh, pay one one time like you just get the the full version of it without paying monthly it is a uh, 299 dollars in my country this is around uh, thirty thousand kenyan shilling yeah so guys that's how you can get it if you want to get another version of it you can get it from a telegram channel yeah, if you want to get some le the the same version a license version of this with a key with a key gen you can download it from my telegram channel there's a link in the description you can get this licensed version just go to the description click on the the uh, the telegram link to get you to my telegram channel you're going to get this one yeah beside this let's go straight to the tutorial on how, on how to add lower that on virtual dj so uh, let me just open the video or is it and show you something so if you guys you don't know what is a lower third a lower third is a uh, it's a, like a, a small quality video that runs down down here on your video showing your social media platforms your social media accounts so that people can follow you your phone number so that guys can contact you usually it is, it is usually used when making mixtapes or in doing a live DJ mix to make it easier for your fans to reach you through that to also create some ownership to your mixtape and also to show your fans who is playing the mixtape so let me show you pretty quick what is a, a lower that let me show you mine so just go to sampler and go up here how you can select instrumentals famous audio audio effects select the video scratch so as you can see i've already loaded mine but i'm going to show you how to load yours so if i want to show you what is allowed that when i play this one keep your eyes on the video you can see down here is a pop-up of uh, the the lower that as you can see it is showing my twitter handle my facebook handle my youtube handle yeah my facebook let so me just switch it off so how to add yours uh, when starting you need to have an already made lower third yeah what i mean by that you need to have designed the lower third which you can design using either uh, you can use vegas either pro pro 13 pro 16 17 you can design your lower third using sony vegas you can use after effects to design it then you allow that so uh, i've already made mine in form of video this let me just uh, minimize this one so i've already made uh, my 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 lower that yeah it has a green screen let me just play it so that you can see what i mean what is a green screen so uh, this is a lower that let me just <coughs> minimize it as you can see while it is playing 
it has a green screen behind here but is a uh, there's a uh, the detail part on the on the on the lower side you, later you shall understand why we did a green screen so that we can isolate uh, the lower third and remove the green screen you can choose to use a blue screen just use a color that is not um, that is a uh, that is not included on the lower third you can use can use uh, Excuse me guys. Yeah, as you can see it is late at night. That's why I'm yawning. Yeah, it's part of the job Yeah, so as, as, as I was saying when making the lower thirds You can choose a whether to use a green screen a blue screen, but most of the The lower thirds I've seen they have a green screen So after you have made your lower third using those softwares I've mentioned either after effects all the sony vegas you want to come and load it to your virtual dj so it's very simple you just come and drag For dragging you can just click on the left button on your keyboard i mean not on your mouse side on the left you just click on it wrong press on it and drag with your mouse to the sampler part of note of note you have to come to on the sampler part and just open the video like that sample apart up here when you open your default setting to, to bring you to maybe to audio you have to select the video on the video you drag here lower that so for instance if i play this the one i've load, just loaded to be to play the green screen just check out as you can see it is playing with the green screen because i've not isolated the lower third so after loading like that just come here uh, right click on it just right click on it you go to sampler editor i mean sorry not sampler sample editor click on it it will open this uh, let me close this one now it will open this part so you edit your sample your sample so you want to isolate the background first come to transparency click on it then you select the green screen after clicking on it, you automatically select, or you can click on it and select the part you want to isolate. As you can see, by click it, it changes color to, to keep your eyes on this part, it changes the color to blue. It depends on which color you want to isolate. But for this tutorial, you are going to isolate a green screen. So we select the green part like that. Then, what you want to do, you want to change the transparency. The transparency is the part on which you want to. Uh, remove the the color you have selected so you want to at least reduce it so just turn this around this one depends with the depth of your green color so you can just play around with it until you get the which the part you want as you can see it removes it gradually so just test it to know if it fits yeah what you want just you can yes yes save, save the changes yeah let me just open the video again so that you can test our lower third. It is open here. So let me play it. As you can see, it doesn't uh, block the video behind. So if you know if you have the transparency is good, uh, click on it and check if the difference uh, from the original video. As you can see, nothing is changing. Just fine. Yeah, so you want to put it on a loop as you can see you can notice is a there's a loop sign here just go back to click to sample editor minimize this one yeah so as you can see i have a high offset mine it is that mode it is a drop uh, it is flat and uh, audio and video so set yours the same so that it can be a loop yeah oh, sorry just click on the loop like that you can choose uh, to for it to be to be syncing when is that sync lock yeah it is very simple how to load it and uh, no hassle just a very simple procedure hope you have learned something yes and just no let me open the the the, the original one the sample editor just the same settings very simple 
about the transparency it depends with your the, your 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 green screen if it is a blue green screen you're going to select the blue color if it is a green the green color about the transparency also you just adjust it i mean adjust it and play around with it until you get to the to the to the best uh, uh, transparency for your specific law that because they don't there's no specific transparency that i can tell you to set just play around with it and uh, you get to the point at which you'll be satisfied so guys that's very simple hope you have understood something if you have any question you can always ask in the comment section if you're interested in the channel kindly subscribe like and share if you need uh, a lot of that i can always make a lot of that for you at a very simple fee just slide in the dm there's a uh, my whatsapp number in the description there's also my email in the description just slide in the dm let that mail you shall communicate I charge very affordable prices, no nothing is exaggerated. The delivery for the lower that is just uh, I mean eight hours until the from the point you have made your payments and you're going to deliver a lower that to you, which you can use in your in your videos, either in the virtual DG software or in uh, Sony Vegas projects. Yeah. So guys that's all for this tutorial. If you want to download the uh, other stuff for virtual DJ go to the link in the description there's my telegram channel click on it it will bring to the it will bring you to this chat telegram channel it is called the all digging softwares as you can see for now you can download the virtual dg skins for free they're just free stuff you can also download the uh, uh, pro infinity virtual dj you can download free sound effects there's a pack of around uh, around 500 sound effects are free it's a free pack yeah, there are a lot of stuff here. Here's uh, links to more tutorials. Yeah. Here's all the other software like Sony Acid, Sony Sony Acid Pro 6, Sony, I mean Sony Acid Pro 7. We shall share a lot of software in this channel. Just go to the description, click on it to, to bring you direct to this uh, Telegram channel. So you share a lot of stuff here. So you also if you need some DJ drops, you also do DJ drops. Yeah, give you some samples of the DJ drops and stroke jiggle. You can send you via WhatsApp so you can listen to them. If you like them, you can place your order. On this Telegram channel, you also share things like step stop. This is a plugin for Sony Acid. This Bandicam, this MP3 tag. Yeah, you can find a lot of stuff in there in the channel. So guys, that's all for this tutorial. If you want to learn more about virtual DJ, there are more tutorials in the channel go through the channel you're going to find a lot of stuff so until next time keep safe be blessed